Lane one, we have Nathan Higgins from Nation's Capital. Lane two, Connor Doyle from Poseidon. Lane three, Ian McCullough from Machine Aquatics. Lane four, Jacob Oberly from Nova, Virginia. Lane five, Dane Ripple, who we just saw in the thousand, will be in lane five. Eric Puki from Central Bucks swim team in lane six. Taking ownership of seven is Nicholas Viers from Nova, Virginia. And John Sita is in lane eight from Nation's Capital. This morning I also spoke with Cassidy Bayer. Again, shameless plug, check out that interview. And she talked about the pressure of taking, of being kind of the, the one that everyone on this 2,000 person Nation's Capital team kind of looks up to. Um, she mentioned that that's something Phoebe's going to have to, a situation she's going to be in. Um, and there have been plenty of others before that, like you, Andrew. I mean, and, you know, Katie Ledecky and all, the, and all the great swimmers that have come through this club. So what do you think is the key for her as she gets older, more mature, and kind of steps into more of a spotlight role on this team for Phoebe? As you said, we're, we're a pretty big team with NCAP, um, and the, the benefit of that is there's a lot of resources and a lot of experience to turn to. Um, you know, she's not the first one who's going to be committing, you know, wanting to compete at a national level. Um, so both as you know, old NCAP swimmers who, you know, may maybe still be around or may come back, you know, are still in college now. Um, there's that knowledge base to lean on, and the coaching staff as well. There's a lot of the, a lot of there's, a, there's a, just a ton of knowledge in the collective coaching staff with all they have. Um, there and so you, to be able to lean on that and learning that you can lean on that um, is, is something that's a, great to take advantage of. Agreed. Yeah, she's you. You can tell from this meet last year to, to this year, she's matured a little bit. She's more comfortable, and it, it's going to show. She, you know, she was comfortable swimming at nationals last week. She had a conversation with Olivia Smoliga, and Smoliga wanted to hear about her last name, which I think is pretty funny. Another uh, Georgia Bulldog who Andrew knows. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, leading the way here, it's Eric Huki. Out of lane six, trying to come back is Jacob Overly in the middle of the pool in lane four. And it's going to be tight between those two as they come into the wall. And a better finish from Hookie gets it done in 154.39. Overly was second. And out, down at the bottom of your screen, John Cita took third in lane eight. And that'll lead us into our B final of the same event, the boys' open 200-yard backstroke. 